day guys and girls so today is april 3rd 2023 and i was going to try to post this on the weekend I haven't made a post about call of duty or warzone in quite some time i know that some people have been asking for some updates on plunder i was actually going to post this on the weekend but again with april 1st being on the weekend you would think that this is a uh april fool's joke or something so you know, uh, I like you guys out there and girls out there love plunder. I love the fact that it is at a slightly slower pace. You can kind of be as aggressive or as chilled as you want to in a lot of cases. I'm not talking about cheaters and scammers and all that other stuff, but um, you know, it's been absent for quite some time. And just to give you like a little bit of a timeline, uh, plunder's actually been missing since November 16th of 2022. And by the time season three of Warzone 2 it's at that release date, it'll be five months that we've had no plunder. Remember, plunder was the second most popular mode in Warzone 1.0, and it's been a staple of Warzone since March 10th of 2020. Three years. Three years has been a staple, and it actually made um, Warzone what it is today. So when the plunder, when the developers took the plunder away, uh, the audience decreased and usually resulted in them adding the mode back quickly. So when they went and added in, um, you know, uh, the armored vehicle, whatever that was called, or or any of those, you know, short time, one week game modes, they lost a lot of of viewership and gamership. And what I've done is I've pulled up an interactive chart here and you can see that in 2022 you know march april may uh that was the most gamers that they had recorded but i want you to look at this orange line okay see how it's all the way up here right peak players a day six million well guess what they release the warzone 2.0 drops down to three million three million 3 million, 3 million. So nearly half as many people are playing the game now as they were back in Warzone 1.0 with Plunder. You know, and when it was released, this Warzone 2.0, the developers said right from the beginning that Warzone was still going to be around. We had to wait a month for them to bring Warzone 1.0 back. And they were going to take away the map and take away Resurgence. That's all they said. They, they basically said, in essence, that BR and Plunder would remain. All they said was that the smaller map was being removed, and they said specifically that Resurgent was going to be removed. They could have just left Plunder in Warzone 1.0. A month later, just clicked the start button, relaunched everything. The problem is, is that they had spent a lot of time developing DMZ, which... I mean, I, I'm happy that they're trying to uh, put some some effort into another mode, but they're worried that people are going to stop playing DMZ, a mode that they've spent so much time developing, and they're just going to jump back into Plunder. And in the case of myself and pretty much everyone I game with, yes, we will drop DMZ like a hot potato and go back to, uh, you know, good old Plunder days, you know, and... Uh, the content creators, they loved Plunder. You know, they could go in there, they could test weapons, they could do their videos. People could rank up their guns. You know, like these hardcore players, they could go and rank up their guns, they could test them out, they could play some Plunder. You know, it was just, it was, it was so perfect. And why it hasn't been here, I don't know. So there has been some leaks recently, but let's start back from the beginning. So back in December 5th of 2022, there was a uh, user called TikTok Al Nuke. He posted a video showing the map locations where you could call in a cash deposit helicopter. And that's actually this video right here. Again, sorry for the uh, crappy content here and the crappy way of capturing it, but I just don't have capture cards. But this is actually where it says call in a cash helicopter right there cash helicopter cash helicopter so the only way that you would 
really need something like that obviously is for plunder um so it probably you know is pointing towards plunder coming back so then on january 4th 2023 bk tour t-o-o-r uh tweeted some data mine game mode icons one of which showed yellow dollar signs and uh raven since complained to twitter and that content has been removed so he had gone in there and data mined or someone had data mined and he ended up posting this and uh you know it, it looked legit and then on february 6 2023 cod sploits posted a third person perspective video showing uh plunder with the heads up display with a progress bar showing cash from zero to a million dollars uh i tried looking for this content his twitter account has been suspended i'll i'll give you one guess why then on February 15th, Call of Duty uh, Twitter account, the official account, tweeted that Plunder was to return in Season 3 or beyond. And I don't know if we've got that tweet or not. I don't think we do. Um, I think they've deleted that one as well. I could be wrong. But um, then in February 16th, 2023, the Warzone 2.0 patch notes... Uh, stated that in a blog post, Plunder returns to Warzone. So that was on February 16th. And then probably the most uh, damning evidence is what you can see up on the screen right now. And uh, that was actually from BK Tour again. He tweeted uh, some data mine game mode icons showing Plunder solos, duos, triples, and quads, which you can see there. And, uh, you know... I would say that that's our most compelling or damning evidence, however you want to call it. But um, yeah, it's just it's very frustrating because, um, like I said, it was it was the game mode that helped build the original Warzone. You had two modes to choose from. It would have been very simple to just throw them in here. I I, I applaud the developers for trying to develop something bigger and better, improving graphics you know, doing all that kind of stuff. But the removal of plunder was just such a big mistake. And again, the numbers show it. Like the numbers do not lie. The numbers are all right here that they're getting about half the amount of people playing as what they did in Warzone 1. They could have simply just threw in a new map, kept the old engine, pushed everything along, it would have been fine, you know? I, I can appreciate that they wanted to change things, but, you know, I'd like to live by the old adage, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And it wasn't broke. It was the most popular and most played game of 2019, 2021, 22, 23, whatever those years were, period. So hopefully they get their act together. Hopefully we see some plunder on April 12th, which is the expected ne next release date for season three of Warzone 2.0. Keep your eyes peeled, stay tuned. Hopefully that comes back, plunder, plunder, plunder. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, thumbs down. Tell me why down in the comments. Constructive criticism is always welcome. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Because remember, you never know unless you bear. We'll see you on the next one.